All right, Jamie Taylor. Well, you're officially home, bro. Yep. Say this was a hell of a trip, man. It was fucking great meeting you, brother. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. Oh, Jay, what a miss, baby. Nashville. Uh, I miss hanging out with you guys. Out, Absolutely, bro. We'll do it again. Yeah, for real. We gotta Definitely. go like a Dodger game or some shit. Hell yeah. Another bridge. Yeah. Another bridge, bridge man. One. Look who's up. Here. Being in Memphis, baby. How do you feel about being in Memphis, Isaiah? I feel at home. You know, I've never been here once in my life. <laughs> Aw, look at this lane of traffic. Aw. Bro, don't be talking shit, bro, because that's going to be us. Oh, it is, because this lane's closed ahead, so. Tired, Josh? Huh? Tired? I'm okay right now. Yeah. Been driving for what, 12 hours now? Yeah, 12 hours. Been awake for over 24. Fuck. Lane closure ahead in a quarter mile. Shut We're up, you dumb fucking route. bitch. Alright. Uh, so we're the parking garage, and we're gonna go down this elevator that is clearly from the 1960s. Yeah, for real. I mean, she said, this just seems more pussy than ocean. Fuck you. <laughs> Elevator. This looks sketchy. But where am I going to put this? Oh, now it sounds like what the hell This looks like a scam. Come on, the elevator's this way. <laughs> Yeah. I feel at home. That's where we're headed, guys. We're headed right over there. Oh, what the fuck? Holy Yeah. Hey, buddy. How's it going there? I'd be able to get the shot. Hey, other buddy, how's it going? Use the right lane to turn onto South 4th Street. Then the destination is on your left. Looks cool as fuck from the back, too. Holy shit.
Peace out. You were awesome, Tennessee. The Mississippi. M I S S I S S I P P I. In 7.8 miles, keep Sonic. left onto. Was it good? Yeah, that just Sonic was good. All right. So the plan is working right now. Roach is throwing out the trash, and we're going. We're leaving. Let's go. <laughs> Goodbye, Roach. We're taking off. We're gonna leave Roach in Arkansas, y'all. Yes, sir. Goodbye. All right, he lives here. This is his home now. The Sonics. Goodbye, Roach. Have a good life in Arkansas. Bye, Roach. Thank y'all. <laughs> you thought he was taking it. <laughs> You thought we were talking. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. Could that guy also be a Rocha? <laughs> Holy shit, he kind of looked like him a little bit. I think he had a little bit. Wait, Rocha, I think Rocha actually keeps when he left. <laughs> Alright, hold on, let's see. Let's see. Look for a big body. Rocha, quit messing around, let's go. <laughs> Come on, Rocha, hurry up. Stop waddling. God damn, how does he hold on to that? I, I, I don't know. He, the boy needs suspenders. Yeah. Fucking waving there. Oh shit, there's a bee right there. Alright, well, now you're here, Rocha. <laughs> this is the beginning. Oh, you were waving that. This Rocha, is the beginning of the vlog. Huh? Yeah, for real. Who was that guy, Roach? I don't know. I mean, he responded to your name. I don't know, bro. Maybe he's one of my Doppler gamers out there. Yeah. That's what you're gonna look like when you get older, bro. Shit. That guy had hair, though. Exactly. All right, Richard. What do you want to say to the vlog? This is the start of the vlog. Oh, I already started the vlog. Oh, this is the start of Isaiah's POV. <laughs> Fuck Isaiah. Fuck you. All right. So we're in Arkansas. Yep. Next stop, Texas. Tejas. Tejas. Home of the Mustangs. Four City, Arkansas. And we're going backwards. The Sonic was amazing. Man. It was. That was fucking good. Got this fucking slushy with uh, with nerds in it. What'd you get, Rich? Lemon lime slushy. Josh? I got a root 44 root beer with a cheeseburger and some chili cheese tots. Yes, I got it. Me and guys, they both got that, uh, fuck, what was it called? Uh, it was like a toasted burger. A yeah, toasted it's like it burger. had a toasted toast on top of a burger. It was fucking good. I don't know why you took out the onion rings. The onion rings made it better. I don't like onion rings. <sighs> Disappointment. You look like an onion Shut up. <laughs> You look like you eat the batter of an onion ring. <laughs> uh, no. Gross. I just gave myself a fucking brain freeze from the slushy, but it's fucking good. You always get brain freezes, man. I do, bro. Weak minded. What's wrong with you? And I drink way too fast. Elsa <laughs> never mind. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Earlier you told me also that you you finish fast too. I don't know what that means. That's what he told me. Whoa, how would you know? That's what he told me? Shit. Wow. He's just getting out there. Yeah, just like how Isaiah came out of the closet this morning, Josh? Physically, yes. Yeah, no. I'm not gay, ho. Fuck you. Yeah, Isaiah came out of the closet this morning, guys. I was like, where the fuck is Isaiah? <laughs> this dude was sleeping in a fucking closet last night. <laughs> <laughs> you should have fucking got video of this. I didn't know what was happening. All right, so QC slept underneath the table. Yeah. And he's going to one-up that by sleeping in the closet. sleeping in a fucking closet. Like R. Kelly or some shit. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, from fucking South Park. Yeah. That's tough. But man, those beds were amazingly comfortable. The they, most comfortable beds I have been on this entire trip. Yeah, they were very comfortable. I mean, I fucking slept literally for the entire night without waking up. Oh, that was that amazing. Was, yeah, I got like maybe nine, ten hours of sleep. Yeah. Ridiculous. I needed that. I'm glad y'all slept. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> I was up since two. Aw. Aw, fuck you. Thank you. All right. We'll see you next time through the Rocha POV. <laughs> so we're just listening to MG stream and chilling. Right, so and where the fuck does rain come from? Advice for the ten man league that we're gonna get more. Into like what the fuck? The oh, of course it's so slows down. I'm gonna pull up the camera. Let's go, baby. But hey, Let's look go. who it is. So, MG. First and hello. Five, How's it going? Look at Josh's two. sus comment right here. Oh, fuck off. That's you. <laughs> <laughs> With the first invite. Oh, yeah, We're gonna fuck. send it to LA Faith. Woohoo! Uh, right, so Wait, that guy? Right, that guy right there? Right there. The best the best so, how do you join the league? I have the yes. 10 man league and I have an 8 man league. What do you guys say to the, the camera right league, now? I'm already sending out invites. Uh, you know, so, we got Big Fridge who's joining the 
Nice. Yes, we got Big Almost Fridge. There. We got Isaiah. Almost there. All right, ladies Gosh. and gentlemen, well, we're back in Texas. This guy's home state. Yeah. We and started the road trip with Bucky's. And now we're ending the road trip with Bucky's. And now we show us a so yeah, guys, here we are back at the good old Bucky's. Do the voice real, uh, Isaiah. Oh my God, we're at Bucky's. <laughs> now you gotta, now you <laughs> do the whole road trip. Now you gotta do the dance, Richard. Uh, absolutely not. This is my vlog. All right, so we just got done playing 21 warm up game. Now we're gonna get this uh, 1v1 going. 1v1 is on, baby. Who you guys got? You guys got the young buck, Gally. Or do you get the 37-year-old, out of shape, son of a bitch? Who's playing a total of like three basketball, four basketball games in the last like fucking five years? Yeah. It's hot as shit right now, but it's hot. That was good. All right. Huh? Let's you go. Win, Josh. Yes, sir. See you win. All right, let's go. All right. Just got done with the 1v1. Not going to lie. That was tough. I am so damn out of shape. It's... Ridiculous. And it's hot as fuck out here. Yeah. Like we're playing in a, in a furnace. But a game of 10. Twos and ones. Win by two. We won 7 0 skunk. It's over. Yes, sir. Isaiah. You do. You do. Hey. Right. It wasn't lying. This boy can defend. Yes, sir. And he can get some rebounds. He blocked me a few times. Got a couple of steals on me. Really fucking made me work. Probably, yeah, more so than anyone in a long, long time. So, just get the just get the shooting going, yeah. man. Just the bank wasn't there. As they was trying to going, he's gonna be a fucking beast. As they was trying to bank in, because he he wasn't lying. He yeah, a fan and he could rebound like a motherfucker. But there we go. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, well, we're here chilling in Dallas on our final night. And man, oh man, by the title of the vlog, do we got a story to tell y'all, man. Josh, tell us what happened in Memphis. It was absolutely ridiculous. So, the night before, after SummerSlam, me, Rocha, and JB Taylor, we're like stuck in town and we're thinking, you know what? Fuck it. Let's just, let's hit the road tonight. Yeah. Right? Because we're mm -hmm. so pumped up full of energy. No way we're going to get some sleep. So... We call up Isaiah, who's waiting for us at the Airbnb. I'm like, hey, you dude, you down to fucking just go to Memphis tonight? And he's like, yeah, fuck yeah. He's all excited. I'm like, okay, cool, cool, cool. So we get to the Airbnb. We all pack up and everything. And we hit the road early in the morning. We drop off JB Taylor. Yep. And then we drive from Indiana back down to, tennis, to Tennessee to go to Memphis. And it's a long ass drive. I mean, it's four hours to JB Taylor. And then it was almost, what, another six? Yeah, to go to Memphis six and a half. With all, with all the stops and shit? Mm-hmm. By the time we got to Memphis, we were all just absolutely exhausted. Roach, bro. Yes. Roach, you can tell me, how tired was I at one point? So at one point, you know, Isaiah was passed out in the back. I was kind of in and out. Josh was just like, mm, man, I don't know, bro. So at one point, Josh just pulled over at a rented gas station in Illinois and the dude just passed out for like 25 minutes, you know, just from exhaustion. Got out, got some water on him, took a walk. It was good after that, but man, dude. I, and that's never happened before. Yeah. Not when I drove to Ohio by myself, when I drove from, from Chicago, you know, me and Sean got in the car and I drove the entire way. Yeah. Like that was like almost 12 hours straight. I never got that exhausted. I think it's because you just, we, we got very little sleep during mm -hmm. the trip, you know? Maybe that was because of maybe because of that. Yeah, I was so exhausted. I had to pull over and I just had to close my eyes, and I did. And yeah, I woke up after 25 minutes. I got out the car. I poured water all over myself. Got that adrenaline back, and I was I, I was felt good. Rocha stayed up with me and yes, started talking to me, and I got my 15th win. <laughs> so we make it into Memphis, and right when we get into the city limits, Jeez. it just starts. Pouring rain. Freaking ridiculous, man. You usually don't see rain like that mm -hmm. in the south and in the summer. Yeah. So I was a bit surprised by it. Um, so we get into the Memphis city limits, and we start heading towards the FedEx Forum because Rocha 
mm -hmm. didn't really get a good look when you went with your dad. Yeah, me and my dad kind of just drove by it real quick because we were on our way, I believe, to Atlanta at the time. So I kind of wanted to get a, a, you know, a closer look, a better look. So at this point, it's raining and I'm so exhausted. And we got in really early. That was the point. Yep. And I'm like, okay, now we're about to explore downtown Memphis and I'm just so tired. Mm -hmm. I'm so tired. So we're making our way towards the FedEx Forum. It's pouring rain. And all of a sudden, an indication goes up onto the car. Tire pressure's low. Not a really big deal. Tire pressure's low. Just put some t air in the tire. Yeah. The thing that sucked was that it was pouring rain. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, and I'm like, I'm about to get drenched. What? Yeah, it was musty too, and it smelled like wet dog. It did. It <laughs> absolutely did. Yeah, it did. Like Clifford, the giant red dog, <laughs> just came through town or something. It was yeah. ridiculous. So we pull into this gas station, and Isaiah runs in. He gets some quarters, and I put the quarters in. And I start pumping in air, and immediately I'm just fucking just soaked. I am sure. like I just jumped into a pool. Yeah, right? for real. And I'm pissed. I'm pissed. I'm exhausted. And another thing starts happening. The air is not really going into the tire. Yeah. And these tires are brand new. For those who don't know, this vehicle that we're driving, the Honda Pilot that you see in these vlogs, that is not my vehicle. So whenever I go on these road trips with these guys, I lend my car to my father mm -hmm. and my father lets me borrow his honda pilot so that way we can have enough room and space for all of us to fit in and our luggage because yeah. we wouldn't be able to fit in my car and it saves us money from you know renting a car or whatever yep and me and sean we've done road trips in this honda pilot and it's happened you know where the tire pressure gets low we just pull over we put some air and we hit the road fine mm -hmm. But for whatever reason, the air wasn't going in. So maybe something was wrong with the machine, right? Yep. So we head to another gas station. New gas station. <laughs> I get out. I open the door. And I put my feet onto the floor. And it, my feet go about that far deep into water. <laughs> Just absolutely soaked now my shoes. Just drenched. My socks are all wet. I hate that, you know? Yep. So I'm like, God. Damn it. <laughs> and I start pumping in air. And I must have spent, I don't know, what was it, like two dollars? Yeah. Two, four, this one, this one was with the car. Mm -hmm. Two, four, six, eight dollars worth of fucking air. Yeah. And I'm sitting there and I'm pumping the fuck mm. out of these tires. I'm using the gauge and the PSI is barely moving. I'm like, damn it. There's got to be a fucking puncture on yeah. the tires. Yeah because I'm sitting here, either that or the machine's also fucked too. Mm -hmm. I mean, the entire city did not look very up to par yeah. where, where we were at. So I'm like, okay, um, obviously there's a puncture in the fucking tires or something. Mm -hmm. Now my father, he has AAA for his vehicle. So I give him a call, I let him know what the situation is, if, to call AAA, because what they could do is they could come up and they can patch that shit up real quick, Yep. And be on your way, no problem. So we pull into this other fucking gas station in this even shadier part of town. Yeah. And when we're pulling in, there's these two dudes. And one dude, he fucking sees us in coming into the gas station and he starts scoping us out like this, right? And then he looks over at his friend and signals to his friend. And his friend who's by the actual gas station by the front entrance, mm -hmm. he looks over at us, he looks back at him and they start nodding to each other. And I'm like, I don't know what these guys are up to, but it's probably not good. Let's just get the fuck out of here. Yeah. So I pull out, and I said, Roach, guys, Isaiah, try to find a hotel mm -hmm. near downtown, and we'll just take it from there. Yeah. So the guys find a fucking comfort in mm -hmm. downtown Memphis. Yep. We make it there. I walk into the hotel, and I'm just <laughs> drenched. I am drenched. Be careful, Roach. <laughs> I almost fell. And also, guys... He's drenched, and I loaned him my TSF Herbie that I have, and that shit was drenched, too. So, imagine that. I'm, I'm exhausted. Beyond exhausted. I'm drenched. I'm pissed. The tires. What the fuck's going on with the yeah. tires? Yeah. So, I get into the hotel. We book it and everything, and then we get into the room. I take a shower, get dressed, and then come back down. AAA comes in, and it's this old school kit. And he starts looking at the tires, and he's like, he looks over at me, he's like, 
what the hell you been doing? <laughs> and I was like, nothing, just driving. Tell what happened. He's like, well, just what happened? I'm like, well, I told him exactly what happened. Yeah. We're just driving. We're driving cross country. We've been driving all over the damn place. We just came from Nashville up to Indiana and back down to Memphis, and this is where we're at now. He's like, this just didn't happen with you, you driving. Did you leave your vehicle unattended? I mean, yeah, I mean, we were downtown Nashville. We park and fucking mm -hmm. just leave, a you know, just be in the city and shit. And, uh, and he was like, nah, that, that doesn't make any sense. Like, he's like, somebody was fucking with your tires. Yeah. Someone was fucking with your tires. And I was like, um, so can you do something about this? Like, this could be a quick fix. He said, sure, no problem. He passed everything up. And everything was good. Tires were fine. Uh, pressure was good. And didn't take much long. Gave him a good tip. And then uh, we went back into the hotel. And well, we, and then we went back out. Uh, down. To the yeah, Bass Pro Shop. We Biggest went to the Bass Pro Shop. Yeah. 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 And then a fucking, we went past the federal building with the fucking window shattered. Oh, oh yeah. You guys saw that. As you guys saw. Yeah, as you guys saw. Two windows. Yeah. Yeah. And the Bass Pro Shop was really fucking cool, man. So dope, man. I didn't think it was like that. <coughs> it used to be where the Grizzlies played. Yeah. yeah, that used to be where the Grizzlies played. Like, I knew it was big. Like, I've seen it and stuff. But motherfucker, it has a hotel. You guys saw the big-ass fucking uh, yeah. elevator. And that tripped me out. I was like, it, it has a hotel? Yeah. An observatory deck. I'm yeah, talking. yeah. And a hotel where guests can stay at. Fucking wild. It's a pretty cool place to fucking be at a hotel because you got... All kinds of fucking things going on yeah. downtown, like down in the fucking building, mm -hmm. because it's uh, it's more than just a Bass Pro Shop. Like they have yep. all kinds of snacks and whatever food. Mm -hmm. They have Wall Burgers restaurant in there. Yeah, that's they right. Have actually, a few restaurants. They have like an observatory restaurant. We could go up to the top and watch over the city and eat. Yeah, that was a, yeah, that was a restaurant up there too. Yeah, but it was closed because of the weather. And there was a bar and everything. So I was yeah, like, you know what? maybe next time I'm in Memphis, I might. Think about staying in this hotel. That would be like, so this is sick. Cool. So we walked all around there. I say, you bought a hat, right? Yeah, I bought a, the a trucker hat. hat. Yeah. And then from there, we took an Uber to a restaurant, a tavern. <sighs> <laughs> this guy. So we didn't. We walked in, right? We walked in. We sit down. The chick's all nice. Like, hey, what are, we're like we were kind of by two tables, so we put them together. Hey, can I check you guys' ID real quick? Like, yeah, sure, no problem. This guy. Is not 21 years old, and the door says 21 and over. So we, we basically, right, Josh, got kicked out. But she oh, kind of how she kicked us out. Oh, she basically said it in the nicest way ever. She was like, "Oh, it's okay. I, a lot of us can't read. I can't read either." And I was like, "Oh, thank you." Wow. I was like, uh, "Okay, all right." Um, so we'll be out, and she was like. I recommend you a place. Yeah. Go to this pizza place called Aldo's, mm -hmm. which was you know a few blocks away, and we went there. Oh, the pizza oh, was oh. fucking amazing. We had not as good as tailgate. Yeah, tailgate, tailgate was better. Pizza was the greatest thing ever, bro. But the fucking waiter, bro. I've never seen a waiter so fucking slow in my oh, life. Oh my god. She was so slow. Yeah, she was just like a chatty Kathy. Yeah. Talking it up with other people. Meanwhile, I'm just like. You know, sipping my yeah, glass like, really fucking hello. hard. Hello. You know, I need a refill. Yeah. But she was slow about everything, so she didn't get a good tip but from me. But the pizza was great, and I, we got some garlic knots. Mmm, oh, so good. Garlic knots were the best thing ever. Yo, those, that fucking sauce? Oh, the marinara sauce, whatever it was. was amazing. I don't really like it that much. Like, yeah. That was good. Mm-hmm. And then after that, we were all just absolutely torn to pieces, man. We were exhausted. It was a day. Yeah. Long day. Went back, watched the Giants end up being the Cubs three out of four. Yeah. yeah. But, man, I got to tell you guys, this dude passed out around 8.30. Josh passed out around 10. I passed out at 10.30. And we all, well, we slept through the night. And we told you guys earlier, this dude would end up being in the fucking closet. I was like, where the hell did he go? Where, where the hell does? I thought, I thought he woke up. Heard us snoring and was like, I can't stand this. So he just went walking. Because I've done that before. Yeah. I, I almost did, bro. I was like, I can't leave. Because they're going to be fucking like, oh, he fucking died or some shit. He got robbed. 
And I went into the fucking closet because I got the thinnest fucking blanket from road shit. And I'm over here fucking feeding fucking for warmth. So I go into the closet. And I'm in there like, bro, I can't sleep. It's so fucking cold. And I get to sleep. And, I, and then like at 7, 30, I was right. I stood up. I was like, all right, I'm waiting for one of these fuckers to get up. And then Rocha finally got up, he showered, and I was like, fine, like, get the shower, and we relaxed and just wait for Josh. And then we went off after that. But yesterday was a very long day. Um, wow. Now we're here. Yes, Dallas, sir. Got last... players of basketball. Yes, sir. Um, we'll have another long day today, too. On the road. Yep. But, um, yeah, man. Crazy. I'm guys, these guys, Josh is uh, auditioning for Casting Couch right now, by the way. Oh, yeah, this is actually your audition. <laughs> My first time. <laughs> Version? That was like this. Yeah, the voice like, yeah. I've never done that before. But, no. you know, I'm down. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen. Well, this is it. Last night in Dallas. Last night on the trip. I oh, was just talking to you guys about the Memphis trip. Now it's just trying to wrap it up in general. You know, it was, it's been a fun trip. From starting off here, going up to St. Louis, staying the night there, checking out the ballpark and whatnot. Then going to Nashville, picking up J.B. Taylor, meeting him for the first time, man. I know we really didn't get J.B. Taylor's part of this, uh, but you know what? Uh, shout out to J.B. Taylor for meeting him, man. He was a blast. Nashville, the women, the food, the atmosphere, the downtown, the Broadway, the Bridgestone Arena, Nashville, uh, Nashville Nissan Stadium, man. It was awesome. Then obviously what happened in Memphis, that was crazy. And now just uh, our last show night here in Dallas, Josh. Yeah. I felt like this was the, this feels definitely like the longest of all the trips mm -hmm. because of all the things that we did in all the different parts of the state. Yeah. You know, we drove a lot. We did a whole lot. Like you said, wrestling, the game and everything. And I had a blast hanging out with Isaiah. Rocha, JB Taylor, we all had a lot of laughs. Yes, sir. Um, I'll never forget that last night of Uno. Oh, yes, sir. We were dying laughing. It was great, man. I thought I was gonna have a heart attack, man. Fucking <laughs> water. <laughs> oh, first Rocha sold again, and he gave me the win in Uno. But fuck you. Nah, we're really gonna miss these guys. When dropping them off at the airport's gonna really suck. Mm-hmm. Got early flights tomorrow, so we'll, we'll have a lot of time to hang out in the morning. I, Isaiah, what are you thinking, bro? First trip with us. Oh, man, it was cool. I really like hanging out with you guys. It's pretty fucking cool. It's amazing. I miss Tennessee. I adapted to their culture. Yes, you did. Literally adapted to the culture. This motherfucker was pissing me off because he was with a goddamn Texan or Texas or Nashville cowboy fucking accent. This guy, Josh. But hey, you know what, Josh? Yeah. First time meeting Isaiah. Yes. It was a blast hanging out with Isaiah, man. It was fun. You know, he fucking skunked me in basketball. Yeah. Not just that, but I also wanted 21 in whores. Mm -hmm. But it was keeping. Ah. Uh, oh, it's almost like I told you I wasn't going <laughs> to let you score. Man. He didn't fucking listen. I was trying to tell him. He was trying to tell him. QC, fucking PJ. But the thing is, I, I felt like shit, man. Isaiah was really defending me very well, like I was saying earlier. And I am so fucking out of shape. It was so hot, man. God, I was really struggling. I, I got to get myself together because that wasn't good. Yeah. Your physique like Rocha. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, so sexy. Okay, stop. <laughs> stop. <laughs> hey, fuck you. That was so much fun. JB Taylor. Yeah, shout uh, out to JB Taylor. Such a great personality, nice guy. And funny. Very Absolutely, funny. very funny, man. Uh, I mean, out of left field, you never know it. Like, yes, sir. Just throw that little line in there and just have us all laughing. Mm -hmm. right. Never forget our adventure at fucking 1 a.m. in the morning to get him some distilled water. To save his life. To save his fucking life, man. <laughs> that was so awesome, man. But yeah, guys, this is what? The third, fourth set of vlogs of these trips. This is definitely up there with one of the funnest. Next time we'll have one set of these. Might have a trip, maybe, to New York coming up. We'll see. Nothing said. You're going to be in my parts now, baby. You're going to be in my side of the city. 
Yeah, I mean, I want it home. Now I got to win it away. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Get you in shape, Josh, and you can whoop this guy even more. Oh, shit. Better. But yeah, guys, we just want to say shout out to every single person who subbed up him, the sports theory, subbed up him, LA Faithful, JB Taylor, and, and myself. Thank you to everybody who came along these journeys. Now, tomorrow, you know, I'll have a going home vlog, but it won't be anything like these vlogs. Uh, we wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching these vlogs. They're always so much fun to do, so much fun to put together. Again, we'll see you the next time a set of vlogs, whether it's a trip to New York, a trip to Roy Rumble, the trip to Mania next year. Uh, guys, these, this has been a lot of fun, gentlemen. A lot of fun. This now, guy. back to the casting couch. <laughs> <laughs> But all right, guys, remember to sum up the sports series, L.A. Faithful, Walkout Sports Talk, and, of course, your boy, Roach Entertainment. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for the Going Home Vlog. Oh, I always put it, I hate putting those together because we're home. But, hey, you know what? Josh, football season. It's almost here, baby. Yes, sir. Can't wait. We got the Hall of Fame game on Thursday. We got fantasy mock drafts coming up, real drafts. Record predictions. Yes, sir. San Francisco 49ers coming up. You guys are not going to miss that. It's fucking great. It's so great. But all right, guys. We'll check you all later. Thank you for watching. You guys have a great night. We'll see you guys tomorrow for one last day. Bye. 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 Hey. I was perfect.